Today, I'm gonna tell you a short motivational story about obstacles in life. Hello, Tom. Hello, desde Mexico. I know about your success, about your YouTube channel that is growing, business channel in Vietnam. I am sure that you are going to be expanding and growing more and more because of your dedication, because of your ideas, and because of the high quality of this YouTube channel being used by many, many, many people. Saludos, Tomas. So once upon a time, in a kingdom far, far away, there lived a king. I can't remember his name, but let's call him um, King Tom. Yes, King Tom, right? King Tom decided one day that he's gonna put a big, huge rock in the middle of the road, okay? So in the middle of a main street in his kingdom, he put a big, massive, huge rock blocking the traffic. And he had spies planted near the rock to see what would happen. Days go by, some of uh, Tom's prime ministers, ministers of different departments, they walk by the rock and they, they did not do anything. They just see the rock and some complain. Some say, well, why is this rock here? How come nobody did anything about this rock? Some people even blame King Tom. Why did King Tom not do anything about this rock, right? So days go by, nothing happened, this rock is still there. And eventually, uh, there's a farmer. He came across this rock and he decided to push the rock to the side of the street, but the rock was just so big, right? He pushed and pushed, couldn't move it, could not move the rock. So the farmer would start thinking, hmm, what should I do? And he thought, hey, if I get a, a really long piece of wood and I wedge, the piece of wood and I kind of use that as a lever, right? And then slowly he pushed the rock out of the way into the side of the road and the rock is no longer blocking the road. And the farmer looked at the ground where the rock was, there is actually a bag. He opened up the bag and there's a lot of gold inside and also a note from King Tom. You know, the note says that I put my, the rock here intentionally to see who would actually move the rock. And uh, for moving this rock, you deserve this bag of gold. And in fact, please come see me because I'm going to make you the prime minister of my kingdom. So this farmer uh, went to see King Tom and he became a great prime minister of that kingdom. You see, in life, most people when they see a problem, they just complain. Why is this problem here? Why is the leadership not doing anything? Why is the management not doing anything? Imagine you work inside a company. There are a lot of problems and most people just complain about it. Well, you know, the leadership is not helping us. Oh, there's not enough training. Oh, you know, they blame everybody else, but nobody actually took the initiative and tried to fix it. And as the leader, as the top leader of my organization, I want people that can help solve problems, right? And those people, I want to move to the top of the organizational hierarchy. And if you're just gonna sit there and complain all day about why the company doesn't do this, why the company doesn't do that, you know, why the leadership is like this, you're not important to us. I'm looking for problem solvers. I'm looking for people that have creative solutions. I'm looking for people that can, you know, help us advance our goals make us become a very big and successful company. So think about yourself, you know, like when you run into a problem, do you just blame it on somebody else or do you try to fix it? What kind of person are you? Don't be a fucktard and take fucking action.